I'm thinking of getting a second GoPro and I was looking at that GoPro 5. I want to try 120 frames. It doesn't have stabilization. So today I want to test the GoPro 6. I'm going to run one time with the stabilization on 120 frames and then we will turn it off at 120 frames and see if it's smooth enough. And if it is smooth, then maybe I'll buy the GoPro 5. I don't really recommend it, but if that's what you want to buy, I would highly recommend the 7 and I would wait for the 8 to come out. Well, 5 I wouldn't do. 6 is, is good. Yeah, 6 is good. I like it as well. But it's expensive getting it that's used. True. Man. Well, we'll see how it goes. So let's check it out. How was it? Fun. Hmm. As you can tell from the footage, GoPro 6 is pretty smooth with stabilization turned on and at 120 frames, that's really good. But when you turn it off, you can notice how more jittery it is. I mean, it's up to you. I do a lot of action videos with GoPro, so there's a lot of movement and I would like it to be a bit more stable like the GoPro 6. GoPro 5 does not have stabilization at 120 frames. I know I want specifically that or higher, but 120 is enough for me. So from this test, it looks like no GoPro 5. Uh, I will wait until September, see if a GoPro 8 comes out, what the pricing is. If it's too expensive, maybe I'll get a GoPro 7 or a GoPro 6. We'll see how that goes. Thank you for watching, till next time.